morning, my friends. I hope you had a great day yesterday and are having a great day today. Um, today, I want to talk about time. And in our classroom, we used to tell time by what we were doing. We looked at our schedule cards and we knew if it was morning meeting, if it was small group, it would if it was <laughs> lunchtime or rest time. And we also knew when mommies and daddies were coming back to get us, right? Today, I want to talk about a different way to tell time. The other day, I used this picture to talk about the months of the year. I want to talk about what we did in every month and go back and remember all the fun that we had in our classroom. So I want to show you these pictures on my laptop that I made just for you. I hope you remember a lot of the memories. I know I do. And let's have some fun remembering what happened in each different month. So this is the little presentation I have. It, I would have put it on our big whiteboard, our computer TV in our classroom. But today I'm gonna to show it to you here. Like I said, we're gonna go talk about all these different months, our school year in review. But when we talk about school, we don't necessarily start with January. We start with a different month. Let's see what month comes up first. September, look, S for September. In September, my friends, you met Miss Cruz and Miss Mann, and you met school. It was your first time coming to school. You had our classroom, the gym with all the cars and bikes, and the playground that we got to use all the time. After this month comes a different month, September, then ah. Uh, October with the pictures. Do you remember what we did in October? Halloween was in October. That's right. We got to dress up. Miss Cruz and Miss Mann were Minnie and Mickey. My friends got to wear costumes. We even broke a pinata. And do you remember what we put inside the pinata? It was candy. Yummy candy. We also voted on which pumpkin we wanted to carve, and we had a visitor come in and carve our pumpkin. After October, there was another fun month. October, November, and for November. In November, do you see the pictures? In November, if you remember, we had Thanksgiving dinner. We set up the family table. We all sat together to eat like a family. My dad cooked us a big turkey. Miss Mann's husband came and helped us cut the cake and the pie. And my mom came too to help serve the corn, mac and cheese, and green beans with turkey for our Thanksgiving feast. So we already saw September, October, November. After November comes December. D for December. In December, we had two, three things. First was Miss Crew's birthday. That's why my picture is there. Then we had our holiday show where you dressed up like snowman and we sang our snowman song. Remember how it went? I'm a little snowman. Look at me. These are my buttons. One, two, three. Look at how cute you guys looked. And after the holiday show, we had a little break from school and we celebrated the new year. It became a new year, 2020. And we knew it was a new year when we came back to school in January. It was a new year, it was now 2020, a new year, we started a new study in our classroom. We started learning about clothes. Look at all the different outfits you guys had. We had the construction worker outfit, police officer, firefighter. We had a lot of accessories. If you see here, headbands and bracelets and necklaces. Oh my. And international outfits, outfits from China, India. We had of Mexico, so many places. And remember, we also talked about features of clothing, laces, buckles, and our friend here is working on unbuckling our game. Great job, friends. After January comes 
February. In February, we had Valentine's Day where Miss Cruz and Miss Mann gave you hearts and some candy from your friends. We celebrated Black History Month by creating traffic lights with graham crackers, frosting, and M&Ms. And we had it as a wonderful snack. And we learned our traffic light song. Do you remember that? Twinkle, twinkle, traffic light. On the corner, shining bright. Red means stop. Green means go. Yellow means go very slow. Twinkle, twinkle, traffic light. On the corner, shining bright. And then the other thing we had in February was the 100th day of school. You had been in school for 100 days. Woohoo! So we had an ice cream party with all of our friends in pre-K. It was so much fun and we ate so much ice cream. After February, my friends, let's see. We started with September, October, November, December, January, February, March. March. March was a very fun month because we had our spirit week of March Madness where we were reading books every day and seeing which one was our favorite. And there was one week in school where Miss Cruz and Miss Mann dressed up. Miss Cruz was a chef one day. She was a sports person doing taekwondo one day. She was a Puerto Rican princess, like you guys said, in my typical Puerto Rican dress. And Miss Mann wore her dashiki for that day. It was a wonderful week. But in the same week, do you see these baskets up here? See these baskets? Those were for my friends, for all of you to take home because in March is when school closed. So that was a sad day because we didn't know how long we were going to be out of school. But I made those packets, you guys took it home, and you guys have been doing a wonderful job learning at home. After March, we went home, and the next month is April. A for April, A for Amir, and A for Aiden. In April, my friends, we had Earth Day. So Miss Cruz took a couple pictures from outside by her house. Here's a little chipmunk. Here's a little cardinal in the tree. Some flowers right next to my house. Miss Cruz started working outside because the weather was so beautiful. But in April, something even more special was my friend started sending me work that you were doing from home. You guys were doing such a good job working so hard at home with mommies and daddies. You should be so proud of all your hard work. After April, my friends, we still didn't get to go back to school, but that's okay, because the next month is May. And in May is when Miss Cruz started doing all these videos. And Miss Cruz had to learn how to make these videos and send them to you all. Here are some of the pictures of the videos I did, and I hope you enjoy them. It's fun for Miss Cruz, but I want them to be fun for you. I do them because I miss you, and it could be fun to watch and do these things together. After May, we have one more month to go over that is part of our school year. After May comes... June. In June, we have Miss Mann's birthday. Happy birthday to Miss Mann. And the start of summer. And that would be the end of our school year, my friends. So each month, we did something very special, had so much fun, and I hope you enjoyed it all. The end. My friends, I hope you liked these pictures, that they reminded you of happy times. I know when I look at these pictures, I remember how happy I was to be with you in the classroom. And I want you to know I miss you very much. And I know you guys are doing such a great job working at home. I will give these pictures to mommies and daddies very soon so that you can remember too all of the great things you did in our classroom. So my friends, I hope you had fun watching these pictures. I know I did. I had fun making this for you. So have fun today. Maybe you can remember things that you've done at home in the past couple months and think about the future. What happens next? Miss Cruz didn't do July and August. 
So do you have any plans? Even if it's staying home and watching a movie every Friday, if it's going to the beach, if it's going to the store and buying your favorite snack, make those memories, have fun together and enjoy every minute you can together, my friends. I know I enjoyed all of our time together. I'll see you soon, okay? Great job. Bye.